Hello, everyone, and welcome to this Boss Up interview. Today, we have Joy of Be The Difference Clothing. Now, hey. Joy is going to tell us all about her amazing business. Take it away, Joy. Yay! First and foremost, before we start anything, I want to shout out Team Bill with Geo. You got Geo Monroe right here. Just want to shout her out. Thank you so much for allowing me to be on the Boss Up show, for real, for real. Um, it's an honor to be here. It's been a long time since we've seen each other, but um, I'm thankful to be here. And hopefully you guys get to know Be The Difference Clothing and myself a little bit more after you've heard everything. So pretty much... I'm going to tell you a little bit about how it all started. So basically, I was never one to be a clothing brand. I, I never, ever anticipated being a clothing brand or anything like that. I, I come from a musical background where I was managing a rap artist, a Christian rap artist. And, you know, things happen. Life changes. People change. And circumstances change. change and... I was left just going to the gym seven days a week. Um, so I was, you know, handling that, whatever. And um, eventually I decided to make a confession. This is my confession. <laughs> I made a confession on Facebook that all I did was go to the gym and then eat Snickers bars and ice cream right after when I got in. And for somebody who goes to the gym seven days a week and is kind of like a health nut, that is like a big no-no. So I was scared. And eventually, one of my family members said, you should make that a shirt. And I was like, okay. I had all this free time. So I said, why not? I know how to make a business. I know how to incorporate. I know how, all of those things because I was given those tools. So one thing I will tell everyone is never despise the tools that you gain from experiences and lessons that you are learning in life, whether they're good, they're bad, they're ugly or indifferent, they all end up working out for your good. So handle them with care and don't be too upset all of the time if things don't go according to your plans, right? Because our plans are different from what the real plan for our life is supposed to be. And there's nothing wrong with having your own idea and your own plans, but be flexible and know that if it doesn't go the way that you want, remember, it's still going to go in your favor. So anyway, I had the tools. So while I made my little t-shirt, I already knew how to incorporate. I already knew what it took. I, know, I knew the cost. I knew how to trademark. I knew how to copyright. Well, not trademark, but I did know how to copyright because I did all of these things for the artists that I was working with. So again, Never despise the things that may separate from you, the things that may expire in your life, because it can just help you build quicker in the next phase of your life or in the next endeavor of your life. So I incorporated Be The Difference Clothing in 2014. And then I said, let me take it a little bit further because I want people to know that I'm legitimate. You know, I'm going to back up a little bit. Um, and this is the honest truth that as an African-American woman and a woman, sometimes the it's, it doesn't seem like it's fair, right? So you already have this built up thought that, well, first of all, I'm a woman. Second of all, I'm black. So they're not going to take me seriously. And I always had that in my mind that people aren't going to take me seriously unless I show them proof. So this is, these are the reasons why I incorporated. These are the reasons why I trademarked. I said, well, I know my company is going to be like Pepsi and Walmart and all those other big name brands. So I'm going to do exactly what they did. You trademark. You know what I'm saying? You do everything that you see a bigger company doing so that everybody thinks and knows that you're legitimate. So I took the legitimacy and I, I, I'm truly authentic when it comes to taking care of your craft, whatever it is. Even if you think that it might be something that's just a hobby for now, you never know later on down the road if that's going to turn into 
your main thing. So either way, you're going to have to take me seriously because I have the, I've gone through the process of showing you that I'm, I am serious about this and that I am paying my dues. I'm giving Caesar what is due Caesar. I'm giving the state what is due the state. I am legitimate. I'm not going to be this one person that takes your sale and then puts it in my pocket and then that's it. You know what I mean? And being that I am about inspiration... I wanted to definitely prove that I was legitimate, am legitimate, and that I can't be an inspirational company without giving back. So in the course of all of these things, an amount of a year or so, I decided that I felt convicted. Not I decided. I just felt convicted. Everybody's convictions are different. But I felt convicted that I cannot be an inspirational company without giving back. It just didn't make sense to me in my head. So I reached out to this local charity and they said, yes, that I could donate. And I've been donating since, let's say, 2015 up into this present day. 10% of all the clothing sales are donated to Hayden's Heart. It's a charity that raises awareness for babies with congenital heart disease. So not only do you feel good about purchasing something that has a positive message on it, but at least, you know, a portion of your money is going to a good charity, you know, and it's local to my New Jersey area. So it, it just worked out. And you, when you start following what life and the way, the direction that life wants you to go, things become very easy. So let me fast forward to what Be The Difference does currently to this day. So I do not only t-shirts, fitness tops, onesies because i believe we have to inspire from infancy all the way up i also have these books here i have two representations of books that i've written they're all quotes and they're all geared to inspire and and motivate you and to even make you think a little differently about life they're all copywritten because remember i did it for someone else so it became easier for me so you know if there's one lesson that you may learn from this little chitty chat for today, just know, do not scorn the different processes and the lessons that you may learn in life because they may be there to teach you how to do things a little bit faster when you come to a different thing in life. So it was easy for me because I already had the thing. So if you want to own your own business and, and incorporate, go to your local state's website and find out how to register a business. Right. The process is all there, you know? Yes. So that's pretty much what I do. Um, I'm excited because I just recently reached my thousandth episode of Hello World on YouTube, uh, March of 2022. And what else is happening? I have a podcast now that I do. Uh, weekly, and sometimes it's live, sometimes it's pre-recorded. Um, I'm also, you know, tuning into the speaking engagement world. Um, I really feel like that's what I'm being drawn towards more now is to speak more publicly and, and have more people that I can reach out to through these events. And I feel like I'll be very useful. I feel like I'll be able to touch at least the one person that needs to hear whatever God, my mega creator, or whatever you believe in is speaking through me. And it's just, don't be afraid to change. Don't be afraid to try something different. Like I truly believe as humans, we were never meant to be in one thing or do one thing consistently all your life. So whenever you feel like, your soul or God or whatever you believe in is telling you to, to do something different, just do it. Because that door that opens for you may create a little bit more happiness and peace in your own life. That, so, is, that is so true, Joy. And I really appreciate everything you just said. But I do want to say to the audience and uh, the subscribers that's listening, uh, that Joy has some very good inspirational t-shirts. So Joy, why don't you tell us some of the things that that's on your t-shirts? Look what I'm wearing today. 
let's make jobs available for humans again y'all i don't know if you've been paying attention but the more we you know the more we throw away these menial jobs uh the more these computers take over and i'm not saying i'm not happy about the progression of technology, but I'm just saying, leave room for humans to have something. You know what I mean? Um, I mean, it's simple. You go to any fast food chain now, you're not even greeted by a human. You're greeted by a kiosk to make your order and a human may give you back your food. If you go into your local supermarket, I'm pretty sure there's a robot scanning around your supermarket saying, spill on aisle whatever. That's a job that a human had. So these are type of things and to build awareness. I do t-shirts that um, build awareness and then I have t-shirts that are just lighthearted. But at the end of the day, they're all there to make us think all about humanity, all about the way and the directions that we're living our lives and where we're going. So when you purchase a Be The Difference t-shirt, you are purchasing and make actually you're actually making an investment into humanity because when somebody sees the message that you're wearing they're going to think about things and they may change their life because of what you decided to invest in so right you know it's okay. it, it's all it's all tied in together right and i love her t-shirts every time i go over to her lives and she be making them right there in the front of us i really enjoy that also, Joe, can you tell them the name of your website and all your social media contact, please? Absolutely. Um, you can go on every social media platform, Facebook, TikTok, Instagram, um, any any platform, actually, and type in B as in boy, T as in Tom, D as in dog, LLC, and you will be connected. The thing about being on every platform and actually following on every platform, oh, and here, YouTube, Be The Difference Clothing is the channel. Um, the thing about being on each of those platforms is you get different content on each platform. That's the difference between all of them. So you should be following all of them. If you wanna subscribe, please do so. And also the website, if you are interested, is be the difference LLC.com. And also, I forgot to mention, we do custom socks, and there's only a, a limited amount, 12, of any design. And once they're sold out, they're never made again. So you have the collector's item. You have something from your, your friend that you know. And it's just also just creating the idea subliminally that it's okay to be individual at, in clothing, that we don't have to dress the same. We don't have to look the same. So... I, I like that about the socks line. Right. Okay, guys. Uh, if you want to know more about Joy's business, please contact her. I will have all of her social media down below this video. So, Joy, is there anything else you want to say? I just want to say thank you for listening. Thank you for taking a little trip down memory road with me. And definitely subscribe to geo make sure you follow all of her pages guys she's here to help us all thank you for allowing me to be here and please whatever you do never give up never quit know that your life is what you make it but definitely know that you can't do it by yourself you got that, people like us here to help you so that is so so, much. so so true joy I am so happy that you came on here because lots of people need to hear your inspirational messages. And so do I for myself. So thank you from the bottom of my heart. So ladies and gentlemen, this has been another great boss up interview with none other than be the difference clothing. And we will see you on the next boss up interview. Bye bye, everybody. Thank <laughs> you.